Uh, welcome. In this lesson, uh, we will discuss uh, uh, properties of uh, alkanes. Now, under properties, we have uh, physical properties and uh, chemical properties. Now, under general physical properties, we will talk about uh, melting and boiling point and uh, solubility. Generally, alkanes, they have uh, low melting and boiling point. The reason for this is because of uh, weak Van der Waals uh, forces. Now, the trend, it increases uh, with increase in the number of uh, carbon atoms. This is because the, as the number of carbon atoms increase, uh, the strength of Van der Waals forces increase. This is to say that pentane has a higher melting and boiling point than ethane. A reason, pentane has a larger molecular mass than that of uh, ethane, hence a stronger Van der Waals forces. Now for solubility, generally uh, they are uh, non-polar. That is to say, uh, they do not dissolve in a polar solvent, that is uh, water. Now, uh, next, the chemical properties. Under chemical properties, we usually talk about uh, reactivity. So usually we have uh, two chemical properties. One is uh, combustion. One is uh, combustion. Uh, combustion is burning. So under combustion, what you need to know is the reagent used. So the reagent used is uh, oxygen. Condition required is uh, heat. Uh, the product uh, depends on uh, whether excess or limited oxygen is uh, used. If excess, then the product becomes uh, carbon dioxide and uh, water molecule. If limited, the product becomes uh, carbon dioxide and uh, water molecule. In this uh, reaction, what you are going to observe is that alkanes uh, will burn with a blue non sooty flame. For a reaction, it occurs you have methane, which is CH4, gas, uh, reacts with oxygen gas. So this one now will give you, this is excess oxygen. This is excess oxygen. So this reaction now will give you uh, carbon dioxide, that is gas, and uh, water molecule. So to balance the equation, here you have two hydrogen atoms, and here you have four hydrogen atoms. Therefore, here you place uh, two, uh, you place two there. And then the number of oxygen atoms here is two, while here is uh, four. Therefore, here you, bl you place two. Uh, the next uh, reaction is uh, substitution. Is uh, substitution. The reagent used is uh, halogens. Condition is uh, UV light. Uh, the product is uh, haloalkane. So, a reaction of uh, methane, that is CH4 gas, uh, reacting with chlorine gas, that is a halogen, in the presence of UV light, that is ultraviolet light, UV light, the role of UV light is uh, to energize or to split this chlorine molecule into three uh, radicals of uh, uh, chlorine atoms. So here substitution will occur, that's one chlorine will substitute one, one hydrogen. So here you will get a CH3Cl gas, and then the hydrogen that has been replaced or substituted, it reacts with the, the other chlorine. That is, gives you HCl. So here, if it is one test moles of chlorine is used, then the reaction now will be CH4 plus uh, excess chlorine. So here you have excess chlorine. So this reaction will go on until all the hydrogen atoms in methane is being substituted. So here you will have C, Cl4 gas plus uh, HCl. And to balance that equation, here it will be 4, and here it will be 4. So here now you will get haloalkane, which is chloromethane. But to name it systematically, then it will be 1, 1, 1 tetrachloromethane. So the name will become there, tetrachloromethane. Finally, uses. Alkanes, they are used uh, at homes as fuels. Lanas, that is the end of our lesson.
Uh, make sure you follow us for more videos. Thank you.